What's up, guys? My name's Ariana. And I'm Maple. And today we are watching Invincible, season one, episode four. Just read our lips. I'm not even singing the words right. I'm like, read my lips. Oh, watch your boot. <gasps> bah. Oh my god, I would never step oh. on a scorpion. Wow. He looks uncanny, like a skeleton. Maybe. Skeletor. Is that a superhero or is that a villain? I think Skeletor is kind of a villain. You saw the mummy, right? Men are too sweet. Yes, I did watch the mummy. Doesn't he look like the guy who like is the rat in that and like double crosses? <laughs> Damn, that's a really good glow stick. Oh my God, I have so many extra glow sticks. Master, soon you will once again teach this world what it means to truly suffer. It's like even the like bugs like that like he like has that piece. Sorry Yeah, those like weird sand mm -hmm. things That movie was actually cute. What were you a I always That's my favorite. It's like master. I worship you. You're the evilest of them all like why they think that they're going to like be the one saved <laughs> I know, it's like like Suspiria that we just yeah. watched was the best example of that. It's like you didn't think that she was gonna come back and destroy all of you? Right, that's... Standing in the, the garden. Bank. You need to push yourself if you wanna build speed and endurance. What, you thought being a Viltrumite was easy? A Viltrumite. I can't, this is one of my favorite songs playing in the background. If you can't sing along, we'll get a copyright strike. Take a break. Last one to Mount Everest does the dishes for a week. Go. <laughs> wow, look how pretty. Could you imagine? That's an avalanche. <laughs> Honestly, yeah, probably. Ah, what the fuck? Oh, sorry. <laughs> it's okay. I'm in. Yes. Boy. Sometimes I forget how beautiful this planet can be. Is Viltrum that different? Oh, it's very different. We've ended wars all over the universe, brought peace to thousands of galaxies. It's why I'm here on Earth. Sounds a lot like colonialism to me. I still can't believe you left everything to come help a planet. Colonizers. I told you I was part of the World Betterment Committee. Yeah, I know. I don't know if I could do that. Do what? Leave everything behind. It takes sacrifice, Mark. That's what I'm trying to teach you. I don't know how I, you feel. I know I'm leering right now because. <laughs> Because again, it feels nasty, even the way he said it. I am Russian, my dear. I know how governments work, and <laughs> it's no different. Cecil's searching for the killer. They know who did this, and they don't care. Olga, did Joseph ever lie to you? Of course, all heroes do. But I only made the mistake of believing him once when he told me everything was going to be fine. Whoa. <laughs> oh, now she has two seeds of doubt planted. Dagger to the heart. Yeah, girl, reach for that wine. A nice Chardonnay. No, why is there red wine in the fridge? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you uncultured swine. Unless it's really gross, like... Private Bowser. Damien Duck. <laughs> what a headline. Can't save, save own soul. soul. <laughs> Boy, I'm lost. XX, XX. Taking out the garbage for a month. Yeah, yeah, quit rubbing it in. A Jack Daniels <laughs> man. I love this guy. <laughs> you were in my house. You oh, frightened yeah. my wife. You murdered seven people. Maybe but don't you're the demon, after all. <sighs> and demons know evil when they see it. If you threaten my family again with your conspiracy theory bullshit, you kill me. Who do you think they're going to believe? Me or you? Fair point. And he knows it. <sighs> Go fuck yourself, dark blood. <laughs> oh my god. All right. This will do. God dang, yeah. 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 <laughs> it's so good. 
good day from the house of the horny. Get a job. Wow, he's quick with it. Uh, go straight for the path of me. Is he okay? So he he's probably building a, the machine to clone himself again. I would assume. And I wonder if he'll make more than. Gosh, dang! It takes a lot. Uh, that was pretty freaking gross. Wait, that's all you needed? Oh. The mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell. Multiplying, multiplying, multiplying. He's making a baby all on his own. Is it? Did you hear about the saber tooth, or not the saber tooth tiger, the woolly mammoth that they're releasing in Siberia? Like they cloned a woolly mammoth? Did we learn nothing from Jurassic Park? Hey, Tim. Whoa, 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 whoa. Were you napping? I was defragmenting, Rex. Okay, well, quit it. Welcome to our new digs, baby. Whoa. I'm scared. Pick up your jaws. You're not tourists. This isn't a holy site. This is your job. Hey, Cecil? Uh, you missed a spot? Left that one there as a reminder. And when okay. you prove yourselves worthy of the heroes who came before you, it'll get cleaned off. Until then, stare at it whenever you think you're hot sh That's dark. Settle in. We'll talk later. Gonna go talk about dark blood. We're cool, right? What? Oh, you mean after you knocked out three of my teeth and gave me a concussion in front of the entire superhero community? Mm, you did kind of ask for it. <laughs> yeah, I guess I did. But you know what? All those other heroes, total assholes anyway. Gaping, dirty, <laughs> filthy assholes. Okay, that's fine. I know her <laughs> voice too, but I don't... Rex, know. please do not allow your personal and professional lives to intersect. When you grow up here, robot, you can tell me how to swing mine. This isn't relationship advice, Rex. This is an order. I'm glad we have an understanding. Ow! What the hell? Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. I must have pinched a nerve. <laughs> soft human. <laughs> he's doing something because he knows he released that guy, so he's gonna clone him probably. Ooh. You think? He's gonna get rid of the original and make a better clone while we go to bed come on you're the wife of the most powerful man on earth you shouldn't have to deal with work stuff did you seriously say that yeah what i'm not just your wife nolan i like dealing with work stuff yeah and i love that about oh, please, you don't give me that shit <laughs> don't you dare shush me i know he kind of belittles her a little nolan sorry I meant to teleport to your front door, but this thing isn't exactly Swiss in its precision. I almost killed you. Yeah, I noticed. Why are you here, Cecil? That was the best night of my life. I mean, no one's done a study yet. Hey. Take one out of limb here and do much? <laughs> yeah. Seems like they're having fun. I expect to feel the same way next time. Let's do this right. Let's go to. Just read our lips. I'm not even singing the words right. I'm like, read my lips. <laughs> and I'm like, it goes lay, 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 going. Oh God, what is wrong with us? What, dude? They got they got the rights to some good songs. Yeah, they did. Yeah, congrats to them. Hey, uh, what's going on? NASA's <laughs> about to launch the first manned mission to Mars. My priority is to my family and this planet. End of story. I Do you see this how? Is the part where I volunteer? And Cecil didn't ask you to go. He asked me. If the kid wants to go, he'd be doing humanity a favor. Debbie, help me out here. How much school am I really gonna miss? I can zip up to Mars and be back tomorrow. The fact that you don't know how far away Mars is is exactly why you shouldn't be missing school. It's a two-week mission. Two weeks? Dad's right. I'm not ready. Things <laughs> remember are going really well, sweetheart. Lots of people are going to tell you how to use your powers, but it's up to you to make these decisions. You need to decide what kind of hero you want to be. She's a real one. She truly is. I'll do it. I'll pack a lunch, kid. Sir, we wanted Nolan off planet so we could investigate him for the murders without arousing his suspicion. What does sending Mark away get us? A chance to see what this kid can do. So they do know. We're having an inkling. 
I mean, I guess it's smart that he doesn't like jump on him right away because mm-hmm. if he's powerful, if he's as powerful, then what are they going to do? You know, people is a pain in the ass. Sure, but it's not like dating Rex worked out. <sighs> okay. The subject now. Look, once you tell someone your secret identity, that's it. If you're going to tell Amber the truth, you better be serious about her. Are you serious about her, Mark? Listen, um, Amber, I'm, uh, I'm... You're what? Volunteering. Far away. Well, that's great. When? (laughs) In 56 seconds. Any minute now. For real? More or less. I'll bring you back a souvenir. What? And we have lift off of the Mars mission. Okay, so he has like a jet pack. Okay, because I was like, he can't breathe. There's no way he can hold his breath for two weeks to Mars. That has to be insane. Insane. Honestly, space stresses me out so much. The main reason you're on this mission is the Martians. What? There are Martians? <laughs> I think Martian man came from Jupiter. Uh, I never thought about it. This is pretty high stakes. It's because it's space. That's like it, why I feel like Interstellar got me because I was like just so stressed out about the whole concept of space to begin with. Oh my with, god! And then add in love, Ugh. love, and Christopher Nolan with his little time schemes. Oh my god! There's this guy fucking floating away. Um, it's a waste of Mark's time. Yeah. It was his decision, and I'm proud of him. He doesn't understand his responsibilities. He's 17, Nolan. He hasn't had responsibilities before now. I need to punch my son more. Since Mark got his powers, <laughs> you've been different. I'm trying Perfect. to teach him. <laughs> you've been distant, annoyed at everything, and you've been mean. I've been under a lot of stress. You've been talking about home. You never talk about home. When I see Mark with his powers, and after what happened to the Guardians, I'm terrified I could lose everything me too i mean you murdered so what everybody. do we do so oh mark's gone you know? for two weeks he's gonna kill his own son remember our first trip together yeah like oh, right like, that's the scary. only way i see this ending hey you asked me what we do we do this Murderer. <laughs> Red rap. stop it you do it so well it's creepy how sick would it be to just be like, fly me to Italy? Wow. You see, they make that scary. I don't like it at all. I don't know. Martians are gonna be creepy. Are they tall? Are they small? They live in the ground. They live so in the ground. Do they look like mole people? Like little moles or? I love a gl- good mole person. Or they like round and chunky like a every, I'm, when you're prairie doing dog. A, aren't no, prairie, prairie dogs, dogs are like, yeah, that's long and yeah, but like prairie dogs like the ones we have here. They like have little like when Is they that sit like a up. Gopher? I feel like you're not uh, doing the appropriate amount of surveillance right now. You are actually sleeping on the job. And your batteries. Maybe they have a charger in the shuttle. What? Bro. <sighs> Saw that coming a mile away. Better hope they're still good. I'm glad we came. But you still feel something's wrong. I feel like I'm standing on the edge of a cliff. And I'm the only one of us who can't fly. Woof. I've been honest with you, Debbie. About what? Cecil thinks I had something to do with what happened to the Guardians? You have to talk to him. I've tried. This could get bad. Oh, God. You, me, and Mark. All you have to do is trust me. Until the time comes where I have to kill Mark. Oh, a dragon it's in Rome. Dragon. You trust me, Debbie? There's, there's a dragon behind you. Please, do you trust me? I trust you. You have no idea how much I needed to hear you say that. Okay. Now do something! Because you're a manipulator. With my beautiful wife. Let's Cecil earn his paycheck. She's like, there's a dragon behind you. If the demon shows up, it gets cold. You can come out. I'm not hiding. (laughs) Cecil. No one warned us about you. So he's framing dark blood. How predictable. Damn, they went. 
car. Oh ew, my god, no! Ew, ew, they're like aliens! Ooh! Ooh! Ew, ew. Like the baby's an alien. Oh, Jesus. Ew. Oh, that's freaking sick. The hell? What the? What are they? See, I'm okay with aliens looking like little green guys. Oh, they're like, uh... What's his face? Where do you think Martian Man came from? Jupiter? The guy who stretches. Oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. I'm, I'm not here to hurt anyone, okay? I'm just here looking for, uh... God, you guys need to keep your dogs on a leash. Are unaffected by the sequids. No, I am very affected by them. I can still taste them. Thanks for having me, Mars Man. Mr. Mars Man, sir. Your Highness. <laughs> <laughs> what is your purpose here? I was sent to protect some of my fellow Earthmen on a mission to your lovely planet, and if they don't get back in one piece, I'm really gonna look like a dick. <laughs> oh, hey guys. Uh, yeah, we don't know who that is. It was a secret mission. Well, you suck at it then. Mistakes were made, but everything's back on track, so... The Sequids are the very reason I captured your people. They are a world-destroying race. Alone. <sighs> Their group mind is scattered and weak, but with an appropriate host, they become unified. They will rise up as one in savage Mars, and soon after, Earth. Exactly like the premise oh. of Alien. So, if you're all good, we'll finish our science and head home. Impossible! Humans are scheduled for immediate execution! I understand. Oh, 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 oh. oh shit. Well, it won't be good if there's a freaking sequid or whatever. Well, he released some too, so what if they got on the ship? I know, right? He just started basically War World 3 with Mars. Oxygen levels, check. Oh, fuck it. Let's That's not gonna be good. Oop, 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 oop. Get on out of there. He got too cocky. Just blast him up. Um, okay. Can I lift that? I think I can lift that. You better be able to lift that. Uh, uh, oh, shit. Uh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, my uh, I'm scared that there's a sequin on there. Same. Same, same, same. No hard feelings, right? I'm gonna take a rock if that's okay. Yeah? Oh, God. <laughs> Never would be too soon. Oh. I'm like grossed out. What? <gasps> <laughs> no, that's so bad. This is gonna add a whole wrench into the middle of this freaking show. <laughs> Spirits were raised as the first men and women to walk on another. So it's like a well, whatever you said, alien, well, but that, like the thing. It's like Remember? a oh, the thing. That's like a way thing? better example. Like Aliens. It's just the, the the little water creatures remind me of what they exist in. Like ew, gross. Okay, no, 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 no. Sorry, no, it is. Thing. It's like the thing. The thing is a way more accurate grossness. Oh, hey, you're. Back early. Also, I'm just really terrified of parasitic aliens. <laughs> By the looks, or any creatures. Less eventful than whatever was happening here. <laughs> Mark. <laughs> so, how was it? <laughs> well, mostly boring. I got you something. Ooh, I've always wanted one of these. It's um. Ugh, what do they call them? A... Rock. Rock? A mirth rock. It's an earth rock. Whoa, even more impressive. Yeah, just make sure you never show it to any geologist or anyone who knows anything about rocks. They might tell you something crazy. Well, thank you for the beautiful, <laughs> regular earth rock. 
Let's. It's an egg of one of those things. I'm, I'm sorry, scared, I can't I'm scared, stop I'm scared, thinking. I'm scared, I'm scared. All I keep thinking about is that thing when it crawls away in the thing. Uh. Didn't try to kill Nolan. I know. Oh, hot dang. This anyway. He can't know we're on to him, or he'll take us all out. Oh no. Why? Why? Because you didn't listen to me when I told you to drop the goddamn case. They're gonna seance him back to hell. Excise me. Destroyed the book you need for rituals centuries ago. The Demonius Ex Mortem? I had a few of my guys reconstruct it. They used artificial intelligence to figure out the missing words. Technology, am I oh right? Oh my god. <laughs> Terrifying technology. <laughs> this show is keeping stressing me out with each you piece. You the one to protect him. See, that's the problem with demons. You only see good and evil, black and white. Well, I need to keep things gray. Until I can figure out why no one killed the Guardians and how to stop it. Say I'd see you in hell, but there's a worse place waiting for you. Ding! Another one-liner. <laughs> there's a worse place waiting for you. Oh. Damn. Dang. Him in that red looks wild. Oh my God. Oh, now you care about the demon? <laughs> he's not dead. He's just back in hell. Isn't, isn't, isn't that worse? <laughs> I know they could have just told him to like chill out for a second. Well, he went and like, he knew. So Nolan reported him. So he had to do something about him or Nolan was going to think Cecil was like really still on his case, you know? Yeah. Oh, robot's back. Now he looks evil to me. At first, I didn't mm -hmm. think maybe he was that bad, but now he looks like. Right now. He is! You were so right! Is it? It is 110 per. Ew. Finally, phase one begins. But he's gonna put homie's Ooh. blood into it. Two more sales, and I'll break the monthly record. Ooh, or is he trying to. You. He's a super thing because you know how you t he took yeah, that blood from him and you were like, I know, but like, is he trying to, uh, like how Vision has a physical body in Wanda Vision, like in Marvel? Is he trying to give himself a physical body on the stack of clothes? Nothing to worry about. Yeah. Everything's fine. Dark beard. Okay. All right. But why would he want Rex Blodes? DNA for a body of his own. Does he want to put his conscious in the Rex blood and then? But that doesn't make sense because technically I understand that he doesn't or believe he that he's being everybody like and gonna make his own evil guardians that he can control. Maybe, but we already know. seen that a homie's cloning process develops a mind of its own and thinks it's the better. The, it's the original. That is true. So I don't know what he's thinking. I don't know where he's going with. I mean, maybe he's the robots just being naive and like. I don't know. I don't Maybe. know what the hell he's doing. Maybe he just wants to take out Rex Blode. Or just the Guardians, because I feel like who else kind of insulted him? Did Cecil insult him? I know someone. A little bit, yeah. I, the little girl insulted him too. Yeah. Even though she's not a little girl, apparently, 24 year old lady. Mm -hmm. But so maybe he's just like, you know, getting his revenge. Yeah, I don't know. But I don't. Maybe. Yeah, his his motive is lost. Unclear. On me. Everybody's motive. Well, I mean, nah. his dad. It's kind of coming together a little. Like I could maybe put to, like I think we've put together some things that maybe could. Yeah. Be I mean, a thing. we're only four episodes in. We could be wrong. But it's just it, the wording and the language that he uses. It stuck out to me from the beginning. It doesn't yeah. feel right. And the way he said, if he wouldn't have got his, but now like it took him so late to get his powers, and now that he's got him, it changes everything. It's like, but why does it change everything? And Were like you him like, admitting, did him you grow admitting, to love him more, and now you're upset that you're gonna have to right. Well, and him admitting that like he didn't expect to have a family, like he never yeah. thought he'd have a kid, like you know what I mean. Like he had no intention of like even. It didn't even. It doesn't seem like he had any intention of actually caring. Like he just had an, an intention like, of coming there to do a job, right? And then it's like the vitramites, like when when your grandparents died, I didn't expect to, and it's like. 
But is that like the rite of passage? Is that why you fled? Is that why you joined the thing? Is because you killed your parents? Yeah. Or is that like something you have to do on that do planet? I don't know. The, yeah. How he was even describing the planet at the beginning, I was like, that sounds like he's uh, being very unclear. Like, like mostly purposely yeah. unclear. Like the way he hits, and then like um, it's very non. Debbie even was like. Like, no, like, you've told me stories, but, you know, it's not like I've ever met, met another Vitramite. It's not like I've ever like been there, been there, understand. anything else yeah. I understand or, like, and it seems like even the stories that she he's told her have been very vague. So it's And, like, like, years ago, like, yeah. yeah. So, I don't know. I think he's just a little stressed because he murdered everybody. Also, let's wrap back around to homie brought one of those gross things back. On that astronaut. So what is that on about? This flag, it's like morphed in. I know. I'm it, like, this is gonna be a whole thing in the middle of all of this other stuff going on. And his first mission will have been an issue. Yeah. He would have caused more issue to the greater good when he was supposed to be. Well, which also helping. then one astronaut was ba- still back there on Mars attacking everybody. Well, no, but I think that's I think the way it's said is like once it gets into one person, it once one gets yeah, into one on host, one. it can then come over. So basically that astronaut, I think it's the same astronaut though, but his body was somehow I don't know. The don't whole know. concept is confusing. That was, the yeah. way it made it sound was like if they get into one person, one host being's consciousness, then it can take over everything because yeah, and that's why we saw that big wave. Because I don't think that was an astronaut that was left behind. I think it was that astronaut not that was being created by those things there right. i have no idea maybe i'm wrong that's why i was like it's maybe it's kind of like the thing yeah yeah like it's like i was like oh okay yeah anyway oh god little wormy brain spiders yeah it's just any again anything that is parasitic in nature creeps me the fuck out ugh. i hate it i hate the concept of it i hate like oh <laughs> so but yeah i don't know well that's gonna be we'll see see how all this unravels in yeah, due time for so real. all right well we're halfway through season one. season one so um we'll catch you guys in episode five and yeah we'll see you there bye bye